to the morning plan. We're only halfway through January, but do you already have regrets from the new year? Then you have company. Yeah, tonight <laughs> is a show called X Fabula. It's a live story slam where people share true and compelling personal stories based on a theme. And tonight's theme is do over. Joining us now from X Fabula is co founder Megan McGee. Welcome to the morning blend. Hi, thanks for having me. Yeah, thanks for being here. Okay, so X Fabula, a lot of people aren't familiar with it mm -hmm. or the Story Slam structure. What exactly is it and what do you do? So X Fabula puts on events uh, generally on a monthly basis where people can tell true personal stories. Uh, everyone shows up. If people just want to listen, that's fine. But if they're feeling daring, they feel like they have a story that fits the theme, they can put their name in the hat. And then throughout the evening, we draw nine names. People get up, tell five-minute stories. And then at the end of the night, the audience gets to vote for an audience favorite. Very what's, fun. The, what's the mission? What's the point to doing a story slam? It's really all about uh, creating community and connecting people. I think it's really easy um, to maybe feel disconnected nowadays, but when you have X Fabula, everyone comes together. They share stories that we can all relate to. They sometimes are funny, sometimes they're sad. Usually it's a mix, and usually the even the humor that's there is because it's so relatable. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the night, you even see people, you know, walking up to people they don't actually know and saying I loved your story and you know what it reminded me of mine and mm -hmm. and they share these stories and they walk away feeling like you know we're all in this together mm -hmm. <laughs> well I like the idea that anybody can get up you can yes. put your name in your in the hat regardless of you know what kind of story you have to tell mm -hmm. and a lot of people who know comedy is based in truth and that's what oftentimes is so funny about stories is the truth behind it and that relatability like you said so Absolutely. you really think anybody can get up and tell a good story you know I think everybody has a story I think some people uh, find it challenging to get up there but there have been people who have got up and the first First few sentences they were literally shaking you know kind of looking nervous but this is such a supportive audience um, I think everyone who's got up and tried has been pleasantly surprised at not only what they're capable of but how great it felt to tell their story and um, realize you know what I can do this mm -hmm. and you know for people that aren't quite ready to get up on stage we do have a format called ultra shorts where people can write a little two or three line sentence um, story on the theme and we read those from the stage so sometimes people will do that first and then later they'll go you know what maybe I should throw my name in the hat well, telling <laughs> so, your own story is always better than someone else telling oh, yeah. a story of your own exactly yes. so yes. tonight you've got on um, this story slam you're presenting your first show that's ever happened in the Washington Heights neighborhood mm -hmm. um, it's gonna be at the time cinema tonight and it's the, the the theme is do over yes do you already know what to expect what kinds of stories <laughs> you might hear tonight um, yes and no we never know exactly what's gonna come up our audiences always surprise us with you know smart creative touching experiences I'm sure we'll hear some redemption stories I'm sure we'll hear stories where people try to do things over and couldn't uh, you really never know until you get there but uh, I know that up to now people have always delivered <laughs> mm -hmm. well, where does it come from the word ex fabula we kind of made it up it's kind of from <laughs> it's, it's is it extemporaneous <laughs> Uh, it's it's really more from Latin. It okay. kind of means of or from stories. Okay. We just like the sound of the word, and we wanted to create something brand new that can have its own definition. But it kind of has the word fable in there, kind mm -hmm. of stories. But um, yeah. and what about the slam part of it? Is that does that get to the competition aspect of it? Yes. Okay. Yes. Somebody's going to end up being the win the winner tonight. Yeah, and you know. Being a winner is not, you know, the end all goal. It's a fun, it's a fun thing for the audience to get to vote. Um, really, I feel that anyone who get up, gets up there wins in their own way. But we do let the audience vote because at the end of the season, we invite all the all the audience favorites back to the stage for a big event at Turner Hall, mm -hmm. and they get to tell new, longer stories. And that's just kind of a fun way to take it to another level. <laughs> I've been to that show at Turner Hall yes. and it's a lot of fun. It's kind of the best of throughout oh, yeah. the whole uh -huh. season. So it's a lot of fun. If you haven't been to an X Fabula show, um, tonight's the night to go. So yeah, we're going to give you the information. It's only five bucks. Yeah, it's five bucks. It's super fun. You might toss your name in the hat. So beware. The Story Slam is tonight. Doors open at 6.30. Show's at 7.30. It's at the Time Cinema right in the Washington Heights area. Xfabula.com. And right now, Megan was nice enough to give Give us a couple tickets to give away. So mm -hmm. call us right now if you can go tonight. 
Again, 6.30, and it starts at 7.30. Caller number seven will win two tickets to go to X Fabula and maybe tell your do-over story. 414-799-4444. Thanks so much, Megan. Oh, thank you so much. Thanks. Yeah. Nice to have Not you here. Fun.